my cat beats the crap out of bags when he sees them on the floor. And boxes. Are you done, mister? Are you done? You get it out? You feel better about yourself? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing the Sweet Sparkle. I have it upside down. We're going to be doing the Sweet Sparkle Summer's Glow Box, which I am really, really excited about. I really do enjoy these. I get these from Octoly, and I always love unboxing them for you guys. I think that they are... Once again, a really great deal for a makeup subscription service. Some of them are hit and miss. Some of them are better than others, as always, with any of these boxes. These boxes are $24.50 a month unless you get it annually. Annually? Did I say that right? Annually. <laughs> if you get it annually, it's $21 a month. So I will leave all of the information on this box, the company, how it works, shipping, all of that down below in the description box if you guys want to check it out. But other than that, let's get into this and see what's in this month's box. Alright, so I'm opening it up and the first thing that I see is the card. Like a lot of subscription services, it comes with a card that tells you the value and the items on the back. So we will go through that as we go through the box. So let's open it up. And I am seeing things that I like a lot. The first thing that I'm pulling out of the box is a lip gloss. And this I probably will not be able to pronounce. Oeno? Ono? Oeno? Oeno? That was my best shot, guys. Now, my lip gloss color is in Bellini, which you can get three different colors. It retails for $14. You apply it for a glossy pout with a nourishing superpower of grape-derived antioxidants. So, I've really been trying out a bunch of different kinds of glosses lately because I found that if I find the right formula for me, I don't mind glosses at all. And this is a beautiful, beautiful color, so I am actually going to keep this. I'm going to try it out. I'm going to see how it is. Hopefully it's not too sticky and it's pigmented because that's the kind of gloss that I can get down for. So it's gorgeous. I can't wait. I can't wait at all. The next item in here is from LA Girl and this is the Velvet Blush Contour Stick. So it is a kind of cream stick blush which is really pretty. This retails for $6. It is in the shade Glimmer. It says create the perfect dewy look with this velvety formula that blends into a soft powdery finish. So I'm actually pretty excited about this and I think that it's a really great idea to put in something like this into a summer box because a lot of us don't like to wear a lot of makeup when it's the summertime and it gets really really hot out and then also like cream products tend to stay and just adhere better to our skin and wear throughout the hot summer months a lot better than powder and anything else. So that's actually very smart of them to do. The next item in here is something that I think may be my favorite out of the whole box. And this is from a company called Hikari, which you see a lot in subscription boxes. And I actually absolutely love them. I think they're a little overpriced, but still, in, it, their products are just so good. So let's take a look at this and see what it looks like. Now this is a cream pigment eyeshadow in mink, which retails for $13. It says, highlight your eyes with this cream pigment formula for a natural, subtle glow. This really excites me. I'm not going to lie. I really, really, I never, I always say I'm not going to lie. It's just a saying, you guys. But I'm really not going to lie. I like pigmented cream shadows because they're so easy to put down on your eye and then kind of just darken up the outer V of your eye and bam, you're good to go. And man, is that gorgeous. Oh, this color, this color is perfection. It's perfect. I'm excited about it. I'm excited about it being in the box. And once again, a cream product for the summer is really where it's at. You can really tell that they did put a lot of thought into this box to make sure that you, you got the best products for summer to use. The next thing I'm pulling out is a little duo. And I thought that this was an eyeshadow, but it's not. It's actually a bronzer and highlighter. And this is from a company called Manicadar Beauty, which once again is just like Hikari. They're kind of more known for their sub box items. And they're a little overflated, but their formulas and their like the quality of their stuff is still really, really good. This is their Radiant Split Pan Duo Highlighter and Bronzer. It retails for $19. Feel radiant this month with this easy to use duo that adds depth and dimension to your look. Now my only thing with this is it seems like it may be a little bit too dark for my skin tone. I'm not really sure. Um, but it's super super tiny. Like I would have thought that this would have been an eyeshadow duo not a highlight and bronzer. Um, I probably would rather this to be a little bit bigger like just a little bit maybe double the size being the smallest because 
you're really going to have a hard time getting a bronzer or a highlighting brush into either one of these split pans to apply on your face. So this confused me just a little, just a little bit, but if it's good, it's good. And the last product I'm not going to take out of the box because I'm going to be putting it into a giveaway. This is just another crown brush, which we've been seeing a lot of subscription boxes as well. And this, instead of the kind of, what was it, um... Kabuki. It was like a Kabuki style really thick big fan brush which I think that we saw in BoxyCharm. This is a smaller fan brush that you're getting in this one which might go well with that little tiny half palette or half um, duo highlighter. You could really use it with that which might be nice but I have a lot of these and don't need another one so I will definitely be passing this on but this retails for $12.99 so not bad. Not bad at all. So that is everything that was in the Summer's Glow Sweet Sparkle box. I really do think that they put a lot of effort into thinking about what was going to be easy to use, what was going to be fast to use, and what was going to stay on your face the most this summer. And a lot of these products are that. The only thing that I'm a little bit downed on is the little duo just because it's really, really tiny. And I thought it was an eyeshadow duo, which that's probably what I will use it for because it just doesn't seem user friendly to use it as a highlighter and bronzer so maybe an eyebrow highlight and an eyeshadow who knows makeup is what we make it so i can definitely make that something so if you guys are interested in this box i will leave the information down below for you guys if you like this video please give it a thumbs up make sure to subscribe before you leave and i'll see you guys in the next one bye